And then, you know, I just come across the next die and really just dive right on in. Hi, you guys. So welcome back to the channel. Today, <laughs> well, the reason I'm here alone is because <laughs> Andrew broke up with me. And it's just me. Hey, what is going on with my hair? <laughs> We're just kidding. I didn't break up with Claire, but these acoustics sound so amazing. <sighs> Are you kidding me? But yeah, clearly we're inside the bathroom. Well, I guess not clearly. You have no idea where we're at, even though the towel's over there. But uh, we're gonna do a challenge. We gotta kinda talk quieter because we talk loud at Super Echo. So we're gonna turn it down a little bit and we're gonna be a little quieter this episode. You might have to jack up your volume. Right now, jack it up. I wanted to scream so bad for the people that actually did, but I did it because I'm not a jerk. Babe, what are we doing in this video? So the way this video is going to work is we, one of us is, well, we have this big old shirt. It's real big old shirt. We have this shirt that one of us, well, both of us are gonna be in. Hands go through. I'm not really doing a good job. Yeah, this just let, let, let mommy do the job. Pretty much what we're going to do here is uh, we're gonna shove our hands inside of the other person's shirt and become their arms, okay? We've all done this kind of, you know, it's where you just put your arms in their thing and they do their little thing for them. And we got a couple tasks that each of us do daily that we're gonna see if the other person can do for us with their own arms. So this is gonna be pretty interesting. Uh, we, we got a lot of stuff to do, so we might as well get, get freaky with it. Let's do this thing. All right, so the first thing that I do in the morning is put, well, really I wash my face, but we're gonna skip that part this morning. And the first thing I do is probably try to make myself look a little better, which means I put a little bit of mascara on. This is my nice Ziploc baggie since I just traveled, and the mascara is not that. Yeah, there's the mascara. So, you know, and then just throw the expensive makeup on the counter. <laughs> Where is it? All right, so the first thing you know I do is just, I just put good old mascara on and I just shake it up, because that makes a lot of sense. And I just am really careful because eyeballs are sensitive to these kinds of things. The look I'm going for is um, kind of a dramatic look. I also really like to highlight my cheekbones with some black, <clears throat> kind of what I would call extreme contour. So clearly not high enough. Um, and then I also kind of like to give my temple a little bit of a look. <laughs> and then I just really go for the eye. And I mean really, really go for the eye. <laughs> and then, you know, I just come across the next eye and really just dive right on in. No care in the world. It's kind of just trying to enhance my features. And that's it for my mascara. <laughs> oh, Christ. <laughs> I wasn't even close. My God, I All right, so one of the first things I do in the morning before I put on my makeup <laughs> is I brush my beard because if you guys don't have facial hair, you don't know what it's like having a big old mammo beard like this, okay? Nothing like slapping it, loosening up the pores and your teeth. Oh yeah, that one felt good. We got the comb right here. So you see right there, and there's two sides to the comb. There's a long side and a short side. The short side is for like hair, the long side is for beard. So gotta make sure you use the long side or else it's gonna little stick to your beard. We're just gonna go ahead and uh, brush her out a little bit. Try not to pull the hairs any. Okay, good, nice and easy. There you go, okay, that spot, maybe the sides a little bit. Oh yeah, it's a little better when it's wet. You know, that's why I tend to do this after I shower or after I, oh yeah, there you go, just use the short side. Love it, love it. Now you do a little head movement like this. I'm not trying to get the mustache. Why not? Yeah, there you go, oh, oh yeah. Oh, okay, and why not get the lip too? And there you go. That's how you brush your beard out. So after I do my mascara and I make myself look absolutely gorgeous, I then brush my teeth. And there is my toothbrush. It might be a little jankity rankity, but you know, it goes in my teeth. So it doesn't really matter. And accurately put some toothpaste on there. 
And, you know. Push it right away. Get all in the cracks and crevices. You know, do everything that I have. have it. <laughs> as long as it's good, you know. Okay. That's it. <laughs> See ya. After I brushed my beard and cleared us all of our makeup and stuff, I like to make breakfast, which is a nice PB&J today. So we gotta make sure we got our, all of our ingredients. We got some bread right here. We got some jelly right there. And some peanut butter right there. Not sponsored. So yeah, you obviously start making a PB&J by opening the bread, making sure you're doing the twisty knob right. There we go. Just a couple more turns and you're in. That's all you gotta do. Then you just reach in. Oh, and I always forget there's another bag inside the bag. So you gotta take that, rip her right open. Yo, this one's tough to get open. Yup. Oh, there you go. And now you take two pieces of bread, not the top piece. Sometimes, you know, I just like to slap myself in the face with it. And now I like to start with the peanut butter. Pretty much, you just open up the peanut butter and then you toss the lid on top of the bread. That was an incredible toss for me, I, if I say so myself. And get a big old scoop of PB right there. There you go, that's, no, that's perfect. Oh, I guess I want more. All right, there you go. This peanut butter is supposed to last me this whole month. So yeah, just spread it open. Just spread it all over the place. Make sure each corner of the bread gets peanut butter. Boom, that looks delicious. It's quite a lot of peanut butter left on the knife, so what I do, I like that up. That's what I do with the BB and J. <laughs> Lick the rest off my hand. Okay, so now once you have the peanut butter done, you get the jelly right there. Nice thing of Smucker's jelly. Nope, accidentally rubbed peanut butter all over the lid, but you know, it happens, it happens. We're just gonna open this thing in, grab the knife again. God, mmm, darn, got peanut butter all over the table. Yeah, and there's probably gonna be quite a bit of PB and peanut butter inside the jelly. But that's fine, you know, just scoop up some jelly here and dump it. Dump it on the bread. Yeah, there you go. You know, I'm not a big fan of jelly, so we're just gonna put a little bit on there, you know? Just save some for next time. Jelly isn't, isn't my favorite thing. And slap her down on the bread. And when you're done, oh, yep, I must have, there you go. Put it right there, and then when you're done, you just, mmm, mmm, -hmm. one more. Just one bite, and that's breakfast. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. The next thing I like to do in the morning is, you know, go for a good old run. And after my run, I always love to rehydrate. <laughs> Hydration is key, kids. <laughs> Pretty accurate. And you know what I like to do midday? You know, I get all this stuff done. I eat a, I eat a PB and J. I brush my beard. I like to scratch my own back. So that's what we're gonna do for the next half hour. Scratch my back, and you guys can enjoy. Yeah, feels good. And sometimes if my foot's bothering me, I like to just whip my foot up here and just you know like just. Just get my foot done too. Cause it feels good. And then you know I like to Ah oh, you're joking me. Oh yeah, I forgot. And then out comes a beautiful young butt. And you know today is a special day because I gotta hop into wow that sun is bright. I gotta hop into the car and drive myself to a Britney Spears concert. I'll see you guys later. I first have to unlock the door. Two fifteen, not bad.